Our numbers can also be drawn with our hand ring without tears pieces. Starting with the number one, we use one big line. The number one is one big line straight down. So I will start at my happy face and I will draw one line straight down. And that is our number one. The next number I'm gonna draw is our number two. Our number two has a big curve and a little line across the bottom. We're gonna start at our happy face and we're gonna draw a big curve just like we do for our letter D. Now our big curve is obviously not going this way towards my water. My big curve is going this way towards the other side of the board. So we're gonna do a big curve all the way to the bottom, a stop and a little line across. This is our number two. Remember we start here and we do a big curve, stop and a little line across. Perfect. Let's go on to our next number. We have our numbers, they go one, two, and the next number is three. Now three uses two small curves and that's it. We're gonna start our number three at our happy face and we're going to do two small curves. So just like the letter B, we're going to do one curve to the middle, bounce out and one curve to the bottom. And that is our number three. So we start at the top at the happy face, we go around and stop, bounce out and stop. This will help us so we do not draw our threes backwards. If we always start at the happy face, our three cannot be backwards. The next number we're gonna draw is the number four. Now the number four uses two small lines and one big line. Let's start at our happy face. Number four comes small line to the middle and small line across. Then we're going to jump to the middle here and we're going to do a big line down. So four is a little bit tricky. We're going to start, I'll show you with my wet sponge. We're going to start at the happy face. We're going to do a small line down. We stop at the middle and straight across. Then we're gonna jump up and go straight down. So you're gonna have a little tail on this side and your four will look like this. You may also see fours that are drawn a little bit differently but we are going to draw them like this. This is the number four. Now the next number that we need to draw is the number five. Whoops, I clearly have not cleaned off my board. And the number five is a tricky, tricky one, but let's follow these directions together. So number five, we start with a small line. We're going to do a small line coming down from the happy face to the middle, just like our four, and stop. Now we're going to do a little curve. So we do a little line down and a little curve around. Woo. Then we're going to stop once we get to the bottom, but our five is missing something. He's missing his hat. So we're going to jump back to the top and do a little hat across the top. So remember we do a small line down, a little curve around and back home to grab his hat across the top. There you go. That's our numbers one to five using our handwriting without tears chalkboards. You can also practice this in your handwriting without tears book and with the letter, the pieces that you cut out in our handwriting without tears um, letter book. Have fun, practice your letters and let's practice writing them so they're not backwards. We'll use the happy face and the area that we have here to make sure our numbers are not backwards.